back again with another music video reaction. My name is Josh. Thanks for checking out the channel. If you click the thumbnail, you're probably here to check out some Falling in Reverse. So Falling in Reverse is a group that I actually did not really know when they originally came out in the early 2000s, I believe it was. Early to mid 2000s. But through this channel, I was actually told to check them out. And I went on quite the deep dive of the Falling in Reverse catalog of music from some of their earlier stuff to some of the newer stuff, including some reimaginings of their older ones. And it's just been so cool to see where the band and mostly the lead singer Ronnie had started and how far they progressed and the talent that pretty much is Ronnie Radke. Like the dude that's known for singing and singing really, really well. Check out the last video if you have any questions about that. But he also decided he wanted to become one of the best rappers. And I'm not an aficionado on rapping by any means, but he's really, really good at making some clever raps. And definitely his cadence is super fast. I mean, it varies a pretty good bit. One of the more recent ones that he did, which was Watch the World Burn, went through like, I think probably 10 different styles or genres of music, including like five different types of rapping. So it was pretty crazy to see his evolution of that. But then the most recent one that I think I'd seen of his was actually when, when he did the Papa Roach song, Last Resort, but it was like the reimagining and it was just him singing it and it's beautiful and just insane. The video that goes with it is also very Inception like and the videos most recently I think have been kind of tying together. So I'm not sure where this one's going to fall in or if it's going to be in line with the other videos or not. But this one's called Ronald and it's been a while actually since uh, that last video came out. I was just thinking the other day about when we're going to be getting a new song from them. So I'm really excited about this. Not sure if it's Ronald for him, Ronnie Radke, right? So maybe his full name is Ronald. Let's find out. Oh, oh, oh. 
All right, Roddy Radke's definitely just insane and insanely creative. That was... Okay, I'm going to have to talk about these kind of things a little bit separately, the actual music and then the video itself. So the music, this was super, super heavy. I mean, this was just like metal of metal. And like what I was saying before, you don't really know what to expect from Monty Radke. And like the last song I heard from him was basically all almost like just classical singing. I mean, it was the reimagining of Last Resort, and it sounded just fantastic. Prior to that, you had one that was, again, probably like 80% rap with like five different types of rap in there, then with a little bit of kind of like metal rock singing. This one's like all metal scream throughout the whole thing. Like, I'm not going to lie to you. I don't think I actually knew any of the words that he actually said during that whole song. The other rapper that came in there, and I am probably going to be laughed at for this. I don't know who that is. You know, if I had to guess offhand, I would say it kind of sounded like Tech 9 But again, like I said, I'm not an aficionado when it comes to rap or rap artist. But his part of the song was also really, really well done. Like I could definitely understand everything he was saying. And then he was also kind of singing melodically with it was really good. It was really good. Then you get to the video, and I don't know what is happening. This seems like this is the same character from at least the last couple of videos. Maybe even going back to Popular Monster. I'm not sure if he turned into a werewolf or if that was like a bat when he jumped out after that helicopter. But this is like, I'm I'm assuming Ronnie is a big fan of just movies in general. Because this seemed like an amalgamation of, I don't know, 15 different movies. Everything from the very opening scene where it was like, everything was first person. I know there was a movie that came out a handful of years ago where it was all shot through the first person view. And it was super action oriented. And it was awesome. Just like a video game, basically. But then you go into like some Matrix stuff, all the way into some superhero things, if they're giving powers or what's going on. Like, I don't know. I don't know what's going on here. But I like it's like he's building an actual world that goes with the song. Sure, they all kind of link together somehow. I think we're starting to figure it out here. or He's starting to let us know. So maybe he got the powers that he had in Watch the World Burn, you know, from this uh, deity rapper wizard person there that gave him the powers. Or And then also, speaking of that, it looked like he was fighting a Balrog there. So maybe a little Lord of the Rings kind of stuff too. Either way, it all just just seemed like a cinephile's dream to really put a bunch of your favorite movies together in a music video and it's just really really fun to watch and it looks really good like again it's kind of a poor state of hollywood that we have nowadays where we have music videos albeit i'm sure they're expensive and very well done but these look better than a lot of the special effects in some movies that come out now so my hat's off to falling in reverse and mr ronnie radke here i'm gonna have to go back and check out the lyrics because i do literally not have any idea what he just said it was all very fast and very growly so I'm going to check that out, but let me know what you guys thought of it in the comments section, and if you know what the song's about, please let me know, and if they're connected in any way. Don't forget, like, share, subscribe, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you would, that'd be fantastic, and as always, you're awesome. Peace out.